Now let's check out the biggest videos of the day in our Trending Now Top 5. Mm -hmm. First. Up. First up, Jay-Z and Samsung bought out the entire commercial break during this weekend's NBA Finals to announce his new album, Magna Carta, Holy Grail. We don't have any rules. Everyone's trying to figure it out. That's why the internet is like the Wild West. The Wild Wild West. We need to write the new rules. What speakers was it? I think it blew speakers. <laughs> I'm not sure if you realize this, but that is actually an homage to oh. Europe's very first rap album. The I, title? Wow, I've learned something new today from you and Jay-Z. You Uncle feeling Jay -Z. that, Orlando? Yes, I am. Oh my God, it's so awesome. It's so <laughs> Oh my God. Oh wow. my God. Uh, now here's Black Box TV prepping an unsuspecting gardener for the zombie apocalypse. Take a look. So mean. It's horrible. And um, a lot of actors were killed with a shovel, a knife during that. But small price to pay for the comedy gold that video is. Yes, at least they died doing what they love. That is true. Now, mm -hmm. for our number three video on the countdown, it's our favorite people, the oh. Fine Brothers. They showed us some teens reacting to Catching Fire, the trailer. So I wonder how they reacted. Why don't you check it out? Ladies and gentlemen. Catching Fire? The victors of the 74th Hunger Games, Katniss Everdeen and Peter Malak. Another one? I haven't seen this yet. So excited. You know, when I actually saw the title of the video, Teens React to Catching Fire, I really thought it was the Fine Brothers and they had a psychotic Whoa. break. But I'm glad <laughs> to see that it was just about a movie. Yeah, that would have been a great YouTube moment. Are you excited for Catching Fire? Oh my God, it's hilarious. <laughs> OMG. <laughs> Jordan, it's gonna be amazing. It's gonna be really <laughs> In more uh, movie trailer news, here's a first look at Martin Scorsese's The Wolf of Wall Street. I get a bad reputation. Are they seriously remaking Spring Breakers already? No, no. Leonardo DiCaprio stars in the film as infamous securities broker turned felon Jordan Belfort. It's actually a true story. And that's a very good true story because that means I still have a shot of my Spring Breakers remake with Jonah Hill. <laughs> still walk, <laughs> Matthew McConaughey is so black. It's amazing. <laughs> he is so down in street, don't you think, man? Yeah. He is just also, Leonardo so DiCaprio danced. Right? Did you yeah. see that? Yeah. <laughs> He's amazing. Oh, and now uh, let's move on to this next video. Before number one, actually, this is a video featuring our own Shauna Klitzner. Wait a minute. Hold on. This is a surprise. Yeah. It's a surprise. My video is not number one. Oh, oh, of course not. Very surprising. But here's Sean and his lady friend, Noel, racing to Las Vegas. She's in a plane. He's in a Ford Fiesta. Check it out. She's my wife. We hit traffic. Oh, come on. She left me with no gas. Just got to the airport. I'm going straight to security. All right, well, we're hitting traffic here. Just found out there's a 20 minute delay. All right, we got like two hours to go. All right, find me on the plane. Taking off soon. All right, I decided to make a quick stop. Look at this, folks. We're in the middle of nowhere. Hey, let's do that stereotypical shot where you set up the camera and the car just passes right through. Oh, so Sean, who won the race? I can't tell you. You'll have to watch the video to oh, find out. Oh, tease. But I will say the loser jumped off the stratosphere. The Ooh. huge hotel. 
Oh, that's like a cotton. That's good. That's it right. is. Well, we'll be uh, checking like in with thing. more of the adventures of Ford Fiesta agents all week right here on What's Trending. But now it is time for our number one most long-winded, nonsensical oh, YouTube yes. video of all time. This one is so good. But just today, here's Miss Utah USA giving an answer. It's definitely an answer to a pageant question about hmm. professional women earning less than men. I think we can re relate this back to education and how we are continuing to try to strive to figure out how to create jobs right now. That is the biggest problem and I think especially the men are um, seen as the leaders of this and so we need to try to figure out how to create education better so that we can solve this problem. Thank you. Thank you, Utah. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> yes, education needs to be better. That is true. But in, in fairness to Miss Utah, she was obviously very nervous. My favorite moment's when she smiles and she knows she is just not <laughs> smart at all. Like, really. <laughs> all right, quick thoughts. Like, Orlando and Jordan. Well, Orlando. I, I have to say, I really think that a lot of the things that she had to say were important. And um, she put some really good, interesting issues on the table. And I think you guys are being really mean to her. And I don't <laughs> like it. <laughs> You're, you guys are totally lame. She's a, good, she's a good person and she's really smart. She went to MIT. Wow. Jordan. Thanks, guys. Thanks. World peace. There you go. And that will do us our trending now. Top five today. All right.